Hi, and so the tutorial I'm going to show you how to add yes, no drop down on the Excel application. So first of all, of course, all you need to do just go and open the Excel application if you have it already downloaded into your PC. Of course, if you have it, this will be great. But if you don't, you will have to go and download it through a Microsoft Store or any browser you must have been using. Of course, you will not just go and download Excel. You will have to download the Office Pack, which includes other applications. So, of course, if you don't want something, you can just install it after everything is downloaded. Once you downloaded the Excel application or you just uh, have it, just go and open it up. And once it's open, this normally is going to be your home screen. Here, you will have to actually log in into your account. Or if you don't have an account, just go and create one. And, of course, you would like to have an activated account or a paid account. So, you can actually use the application because the Office apps are paid. Once you're here, you can just go and click as new. So you can uh, create a new blank workbook or just choose some of their templates to start with. Or you can just go and open uh, some saved files if you have it on your PC. For me, I'm just going to open a blank workbook document. And here, as we said, we would like to add a yes or no drop down on the Excel application. So, how to add yes or no to a drop down? So, we'd like to select the cells you want uh, where you want to include this information. So Let's just add here four cells as an example. Okay, so G, K, and L. And let's just select those cells. So here, now we would like to click at the data option at the top here. And of course, uh, sorry. So now we'd like to select it, then go to data. Now you'd like to go to this data validation and make sure to go and click on it. And as you can see here, so now go here to list uh, sorry go here to list make sure to check this ignore blank and incel drop down if you don't have it checked and of course and the source option just click at yes and no click at okay and now as you can see if we click on it on this or this or this or this we will have like here an option if we click on this as you can see we can select yes or no so this will be actually for this tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.